What's going on guys? Kelvin here and welcome to 320 Tech. There are so many amazing watch faces being released every single day. And I make sure to install every single one because it makes me feel like I have a brand new watch every single day. Last week, I showed you guys how to store multiple watch faces on Clockology so you don't have to sync it over and over and over and over and over and over and over again. If you haven't watched that video, check it out now for a step-by-step -step guide on how to get everything set up. But one of the biggest issues that I experienced on Clockology was having to constantly swipe through my watch faces throughout the entire day. And I had to do that, otherwise I wouldn't be able to use those amazing watch faces that I just installed. But if you're like me, you don't have time to constantly swipe through the watch throughout the entire day. I mean, wouldn't it be awesome, and I mean awesome, if whenever I raise my wrist, I'd see a different watch face? Man, I gotta contact Mike and tell him to put this feature in ASAP. One hour later. Hey Mike, how's it going? Yeah, Clockology is great, man. Anyways, man, I have an idea for a feature. I was thinking if we put the... What? In the last update, why don't you say anything? Change log. You know I don't read that stuff. Hello? Mike? Hello? <sighs> Silly iPhones. <sighs> Should have bought a Samsung. In today's video, I want to show you guys how to enable the random clocks feature on Clockology. Let's do this. Now, the very first thing that you guys want to do is disable the replace clocks feature. What this will allow you guys to do is add and delete multiple watch faces at a time. Because if you think about it, if you want random watch faces on your Apple Watch, you're going to need more than one watch face, right? Cool. Let's head over to my iPhone. Now to keep things simple, I'm going to sync three watch faces to show you guys how this feature works. So let's head over to Clockology and find a really cool watch face. Mm, this one over here is really, really cool. We'll long hold onto it and then press watch sync. Now the important part is you want replace clocks to be off for this to work. Replace clocks is off. Awesome. Then we press sync. And there you guys go. Now let's do the same thing, but for two other watch faces. Okay, this one over here, long hold, watch sync, replace clocks is off, awesome, sync. There's a second one. Uh, this one over here is really cool. Long hold, watch sync, replace clocks is off, awesome again, sync, done. That was too easy. Now that all my favorite watch faces have been synced, let's head over to my Apple Watch. Let's go on any watch face that I have, long hold on it and press random clock. From here, whenever you raise your wrist, you'll be greeted with one of your favorite watch faces that you just synced before on your iPhone. Before you guys go, there's a few more options that you guys might want to consider. Let me show you guys. Let's long hold on your watch face, press option, Scroll down until you see a heading that says random delay and it's exactly what you think it does. With this option, you guys are able to have your watch face change at specific time intervals instead of every single time you raise your wrist. The list includes time intervals of none, 5, 10, 30 or 60 minutes. This is a great feature to have if you want to experience a brand new watch face at specific times of the day. I personally have a set to change at every 60 minutes so that I can be inspired by a brand new watch face at every single hour of my day. Let me know in the comments what time interval that you guys set for your random clock. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you guys want to see some more Clockology content in the future. All right, thanks again for watching and I'll see you guys next time.